everybody and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we're going to be playing around with some makeup and creating some of 2016-2017 makeup trends. And of course, I myself use some of these, but in moderation. My favorite one being strobing. I think strobing is my favorite one. That is such a pretty trend, making the skin look like goddess. But yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you guys aren't already. It's down there completely free. Hit that button down there. If you guys like my videos, give it a huge thumbs up. But yeah, without further ado, if you guys are interested in seeing how I create these makeup trends, then just keep on watching. <laughs> Let's get started. So the first trend was excessive contouring or really defined contouring and highlighting. And of course, contouring wasn't enough. We need to bronze up a little more. I thought I forgot the nose. Of course, we're also contouring that nose. Gotta make it skinny. And of course, another makeup trend was baking. The famous King K baking, at least for five minutes, leave it in there and to make those illuminated areas even more illuminated. Mm -hmm. And after I bake for five minutes, we're gonna take it off and see what this bad boy did to our face. Okay, okay, I can see the difference. I don't know about you guys in camera, but I could totally see these eyes more illuminated the makeup than trend was strobing let's take a look strobing is really more settled more um just a little glow to your face uh rather than highlighter that is a more boom bam there i am see so just a strobing more. is really just uh illuminating um your top points of your face but as well as the rest of your face or wherever you want to apply it so really just Give it a little glow to your face. Okay, it's right there. It looks really nice, actually. It looks very natural. Almost you can barely catch it on camera, but it does look really natural, really nice. Like, the sun is just hitting you. And, and you of course, up. another one was the bold eyebrows. Let's not forget. So here's kind of like the difference between the more natural brows and the really defined, bold, dark eyebrows. Okay, and another really famous makeup trend that was trending were the so famous freckles. These bad boys. Ladies with freckles, don't be ashamed with it because it is actually a trend. A very, very, very big makeup trend was uh, lip overlining, and we all know who started this trend. So here, here we go. go. 
um no guys um my lips are 100% real I did not get lip fillers <laughs> another makeup trend that was really trending all 2016 2017 has been the red lips started by the famously Kendall Jenner Makeup trend that was really trending all 2016-17 was, of course, glitter highlighter. Mm -hmm. Gotta bring it up, you know. You gotta bring your highlighter up. Mm -hmm. another makeup trend that I feel like really very few people know about it because back in my days when people used to wear makeup I remember the blush was used down here and now we want to smile perk our cheeks and just dab make a little apple cheeks right there and dab 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 I should have let that dried and of course let's not forget our very big overdrawn wing liner So there you have it, a lot of 2016-2017 makeup trends, and I myself do use many of these, but in moderation. You of course don't want to go ahead and do this for an everyday or even an event makeup. Yeah, uh, myself use um, the cheeks. I also do contouring, highlighting, and baking, and maybe for a very special event or a very special makeup tutorial, I'll use the wing dramatic wing liner, but. Come on, um, highlighter, freckles, and these ginormous lips. I'm not such a fan of, but hey, everybody has their own opinions, right? So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a huge thumbs like, thumbs up if you like this video. And I'll see you next time. Bye!